السلام علیکم فرینڈس آئی ایم آئی ٹیچ نے سوان سو فرسٹ آف آل آئی ایم ایکسٹریملی سوری دیٹ آئی ایم اوے فرام کپل آف ویکس سو آئی ایم ایکسٹریملی سوری فار دیٹ اینڈ دا ریزن فار مائی ایبسنس از یو نو لائک آل ویز ایگزامس السلام علیکم فرینڈس آئی ایم آئی ٹیچ نسوان سو فرسٹ آف آل آئی ایم ایکسٹریملی سوری دیٹ آئی ایم اوے فرام کپل آف ویکس سو آئی ایم ایکسٹریملی سوری فار دیٹ اینڈ دا ریزن فار مائی ایبسنس از یو نو لائک آل ویز ایگزامس سو now what we will do we will go to define and define we will define some material for us assalamu alaikum friends i am a teacher in asawan so first of all i am extremely sorry that i am away from couple of weeks so i'm extremely sorry for that and the reason for my absence is you know <laughs> like all the exams so Here, let me use some steel, or you can also use concrete. So I am using steel over here, and I am modifying load pattern. In this load pattern, we have self weight multiplier of one. That means it includes the self weight. So here, we don't want to include self weight because I am doing just for demonstration purpose, right? If you are doing this, you can add another load pattern here, name as temperature, and then you can go on with that thing. So I am here just. its multiplier weight multiplier from 1 to 0 modify it if it jam into 0 and then press okay so now what will you do now if you want to see the behavior of the pressure over beams only you can select beams and you can go to assign and assign and to go to frame slot and go to the temperature So in temperature you have a lot of options you can just define your load pattern name so in this case we have only that load and you can define your temperature gradient by just temperature this will take the temperature effect on the whole, on the whole member and this will temperature gradient in two two direction right 
and there is temperature gradient in 3 3 direction in 3 3 axis so basically these are the axis you can apply anywhere but uh, let's keep it temperature because we want to get its effect on all our member now you can apply here by element temperature and by joint pattern so we will apply here by element pattern so let's change it so our units are here in kip inch fahrenheit here so what will we do we will define our change in load change in temperature in fahrenheit so let's say my temperature is changing to 70 degree fahrenheit place the existing load and press ok so it shows me that your beams that effect of 70 degree fahrenheit temperature affects the nature of your beams so now what will you do we will go to analyze analysis option to plan frame and we will run the analysis so you can see the effects by just going to the option and going to frames and frames you can select a combination name and uh, i want to see so actually these are the member forces for the frames so you can see the moment and uh, press ok so these are the values of moment at the specific location then the temperature increases to 70 degree Fahrenheit so now let's let me just clarify for this just unlock the model and uh, select your beams again go to assign go to frame loads and change these loads to let's say uh, this time go to 40 degree Fahrenheit let's go this time just change it to minus 40 Fahrenheit press ok and now run the analysis now you can see the moments the moments are changed so basically this is the procedure of introducing the effect of temperature to your structure I hope this is useful comment down and thumb up the video and do not forget to share this video with your friends thank you